the Holy See condemns terrorism in the strongest terms and recalls that terrorism can only be countered by more cohesive measures at the international level. As terror knows no border, the international community as a whole must deny terrorists access to cyber technologies to recruit new adherents from different parts of the world or finance their activities and coordinate terror attacks. No one should be allowed to finance or to provide arms and ammunition to terrorists. The tragic event of that fateful morning four years ago, which caused death and great suffering, is still fresh in the minds of the people, and particularly of the directly affected. We grieve that the truth behind it is still evading us. The commemoration ceremonies are definitely not to seek revenge, but to pray and seek justice for the innocent victims. As Pope Francis wrote in the encyclical letter, Fratelli Tutti, I quote, justice is properly sought solely out of love of justice itself, out of respect for the victims as a means of preventing new crimes and protecting the common good, not as an alleged outlet for personal anger. Forgiveness is precisely what enables us to pursue justice without falling into the spiral of revenge or the injustice of forgetting. End of quotation. At the same time, we recall that such contemptible acts go against the teachings of the four major religions practiced in this beautiful island and which unreservedly condemned the act. I earnestly appeal that we continue to pray for the victims, the martyrs of the attacks, that they remain in the presence of God. In the Book of Wisdom, we read that the souls of the righteous are in the hand of God, and no torment will ever touch them. At the same time, we also implore them to intercede for us, knowing that the blood of martyrs is the seed for the growth of the church. As we renew our commitment to never let such atrocities happen again, I wish to conclude in the words of the 44th President of the United States of America, Mr. Barack Obama. He said, no religion is responsible for terrorism. People are responsible for violence and terrorism. I bring to all the affected and all Sri Lankans the blessings of the Holy Father, Pope Francis. Thank you for your attention. <laughs>